Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will show you how to create this amazing split wall uh, art design in Canva, which was inspired by Reno Nadiandi. You can find his YouTube channel in the description. But before we dive into the tutorial, I have a quick favor to ask. If you like my content and find it valuable, please take a moment and hit that small like button and subscribe to my channel. Is it really helps to keep creating content for you? Thanks, and now let's get started. I already opened the new page. And here first we need to add the image we would like to split. And now I try to do it with, uh, with New York. I'm looking for a photo. This one is, I think, looks really good. I just... Uh, Increasing the size a bit, position, going to the center, nice. And now I start to use the rulers from the from the side. If you do not have it, you can uh, turn on with the shift R or turn on, turn off, or go into the file settings and show rulers and guides. So I just... Uh, uh, moving my mouse here let's do it. and start to moving the the ruler just uh, keep my finger on the left mouse button this one the first piece and the second piece and one more and one more and just try to create this uh, small pieces what I need even one more to here and I think this will be two more one here yes one small to here And now I just need to duplicate the original image because I need one, two, three, four, five, six pieces. Six pieces. Select all, position, middle, and center. And I missed something, I think. It's supposed to be a seventh one also, I think, and need more rulers, so I need or was not in a sorry, I just tried to figure out how was it like this. So this one a bit smaller and this one is also a bit supposed to be a bit smaller and this one also just to get more space for the last piece Now this one bit to the left, like this, and I need one more, like this, but I think I can move it a bit. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces I need, and just go into the position seven pieces I have. So I'm going to the first one. I just cut it to here. Going to the second one. Cut between those two. Third one. The 
fourth one. Fifth. And slip to here. Six. And this one. And the seventh one. I just. Yeah, like this. Exactly. And now I just start to cut also from that top and bottom just to make it more funnier. Just moving a bit more, starting to the top, even here. And now this one going down and like here, even more than, oops. Don't want to move it, I just want to cut it like this, and this one is even more higher like this. I think now it uh, looks uh, really good. The thing what I need to do now, I have to download it. So, best possible size and with transparent background just wait until the it's a bit downloaded yes it's downloaded i just have to loading back and have to set the same size as the original one so I just, uh, the good thing, I just had to fit the whole uh, Canva with it. So I go into the edit. And first I'm going to the Duotone. Click on any, because I'm just creating a shadow. And going back to the edit, scrolling down to the blur, whole image, like I try to with 40% and now I just uh, with the cursor I'm moving it down and moving to it right and going back to the positions and just moving to the bottom and I does only one thing needed before I set the background I select all the items except the shadow going to the border style I just give it one and now i can change the border color to white okay it's good and i go back to the elements and looking for a black wall something dark or something dark not with those sorry that's i need a photo like gray yes dark gray is better than uh bricks i'm looking for bricks yes this one will be perfect i think i can use even this one or try no this is not good yeah, this is also not so good. Try to find a proper one. Replace background. No. The first one was good. This. Yeah, I like this uh, final outcome. Maybe I can find a bit better uh, background, but now you can see how easy it works, how the what was the concept. How we have to create this uh, split wall art design and now this is the end of the tutorial hope so you like it if you did really like it please do not forget to hit that small like button subscribe to my channel leave comment in the comment section if i miss anything from the canva or if you're struggling anything in canva 
and I try to answer it as soon as possible. I have to say, I have to say thank you again for Reno Nadia Andy for the inspiration. As I mentioned already, you can find his uh, YouTube channel, actually the link of his YouTube channel in the description. And please also visit my Facebook page where you can find another great uh, Canva tutorials, not only from me, also from another great uh, Canva experts. Plus you can find a bunch of text to image uh, prompts for image generation for different kinds of AI tools. So if you are also interested on in this area, please feel free to check my Facebook page. Plus now I started my TikTok and YouTube also, uh, uh, Instagram also, sorry. Please also visit my TikTok and Instagram page also. You can find also the link in the description. But now this tutorial really going to the end. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Ciao.